Hello friends, welcome once again to our brooding experience series. As you have seen at the background, our birds are really coming up good. You see this is week 11 and we've made considerable progress with their development. Today again, we are going to be administering another vaccination which is uh, aimed at protecting them against the Newcastle disease. It is called the Komarov vaccine and we'll be giving it in a little while. However, before we do that, we'll try to separate them and merge them into one section so we can pick them one after the other and, you know, administer to make it easier to get them and also so we do not miss out on any bird because when you are vaccinating it's important that every bird that um, is in your pen should receive the vaccination none should be left out and so in a short while from now we'll begin the process welcome back to our series on the brooding and today we'll be discussing another vaccination which is also a newcastle vaccine and today we'll be talking about the comoro strain of the vaccine now if you've been following our previous series you realize that we once talked about newcastle and we talked about the different strains and the different types of vaccines and what newcastle is entirely now newcastle disease is a viral disease of poultry which comes in four different forms we have the respiratory we have the digestive we have the reproductive and then we have the nervous form and then I talked about the last one, which is mostly not discussed, which is usually the asymptomatic forms. So basically, we have five forms of which, out of those five forms, four are the major ones of economic importance to the farmer. The respiratory, the digestive, the reproductive, as well as the nervous form. The nervous form is the terminal from where you have the neck twisting, either twisting to the side or upwards, what we call stargazing why the, the reproductive form will basically affect the reproductive system and then that affects egg laying. The respiratory form affects the respiratory system where you have similar signs like your birds are having CRD. And then we also talked about uh, the digestive form which affects basically the digestive system and that will affect nutrient absorption. And of course, you know, once your birds are not absorbing nutrients as they are supposed to, growth and production just are impaired. So this is our vaccine. Let's take a look at it. Here we have it in our transporting medium, which is the ice pack. And this is our vaccine as it is. So today we'll be looking at taking the Komarov strain, which is the oil emulsion or what is called the oil base. And this is going as an injectable vaccine, which is administered at 0.5 mil to the beds, either intramuscularly or subcutaneously. 